welcome to Kids Church Online. My name is Sophie and we are at episode four of Love of Mercy. I know, it's crazy. You're like, how much more mercy can there be? Well, let me tell you, today is all about helping the hurting. I know we kind of looked at that last week because that was how someone was kind to someone else. But this time we're going to look at an example of a guy called Peter and a girl called Tabitha. It's going to be epic. There is also going to be some more next-gen faces that you might not have seen for a while feature. So get excited. We believe God wants to speak to you powerfully. We believe that God wants to use you to speak to your friends, to speak to your teachers, to speak to your parents, to speak to your brothers, even your sisters. We believe that God wants to use you mightily. And so why don't you get ready for this morning, grab your Bible. Oh, got mine got my bible get it get it ready we believe god can speak to you powerfully through it it's going to be a cracking morning get ready this is the story about the god who loves us in the bible we find truth and purpose to love god and love others we're searching god's word for things to discover is alive in the city of joppa there was a follower named tabitha hi tabitha her greek name was dork uh, uh i mean dorcas she was always doing good deeds like sewing clothes for people and cooking them yummy meals Mmm, that smells good. A big portion for me, please. Yeah, and more. And some more. Yes. Yum. And kind acts for people too, like bringing them gifts. But one day she got sick, <coughs> so sick that she died. <coughs> oh no! Oh. Yeah, yep, yeah, she's definitely dead. No, Barney, she's dead. So they washed the body. Yeah, give her a good scrub and laid her in an upstairs room. Now Peter was in a nearby town, so they sent two messengers who begged him, hurry, please come, you've got to come. So he came. Yeah, off he went. Quick, go with him. And he went upstairs to the upper room where they were keeping Tabitha. Oh, all the people were there. They were so sad. They were distraught. They showed Peter all of the clothes that Tabitha had made. The coats and the shirts that she'd sewed. Yeah, I know, Tabitha made them. Amazing, aren't they? So Peter knelt down next to the body and he prayed. And he prayed. And he prayed a bit more. And then he said, Tabitha, stand up. She opened her eyes. When she saw Peter, she sat up. He gave her his hand and helped her up. Then he called in all the people who'd been mourning and showed them that Tabitha was alive. Yeah! It's amazing! It's a miracle! Tabitha's alive!
My Bible. There's this really interesting story. Uh, Acts nine. Do <laughs> that. I want to read you, if you don't mind. Just listen up for me. Here we are. At Joppa, there was a certain disciple named Tabitha, which is translated to Dorcas. Dorcas. <laughs> this woman was full of good works and charitable deeds, which she did. But it happened in those days that she came sick and died. <laughs> she died. That was, that's sad, isn't it? Um, when they have had Washed her, they laid her in the upper room. So upstairs, I guess they mean by that. Upstairs? Yeah, okay, makes sense, okay. Um, where are we? And since Lida, the Lida, Lida? Ooh, weird name, weird name, I don't know, was near Joppa, and the disciples had heard that Peter was there, they sent two men into him, to him, imploring him not to delay them coming to him. So, in other words, uh, get him right now, I want him to come right now, alright? Then Peter arose and went with them. When he had come, they brought him to the upper room. So, where? Door. This one is Tabitha. It just sounds like I think I like the Tabitha. Tabby. Tabitha. Um. Uh, brought him to the upper room and all the widows stood by him weeping, showing the tunics and garments with Dorcas. Had made while she was with them, but Peter put them all out and knelt down and prayed, and turned to the body and he said, Tabitha, arise. And said, everyone arise. <laughs> and uh, when he had called the saints and widows, he presented her alive, and it became known throughout all Joppa, so he believed on the Lord. That's a nice bridal. Let me just uh, talk to you a little bit about that. So, there's this lovely, lovely disciple known as. Tabitha, Tabby, Dorcas. <laughs> Wanna go for Dorcas? And uh, she was a really nice person. She helped the poor at all times. She would do everything to make everyone else feel better. You know, she'd always look after everyone else around her. And then, sadly, she died. It's a shame it happens, but she died. But then, in the faith of the Lord, they got pieces to pray in the power of God. And Simply like that, she came alive again, and she can bless so many more than that. You've got to remember, alright, you must love all with mercy, and look after everyone around you, whether lower or higher than you. I miss you all, I'll see you soon. Thank you so much, Isaac. That was a great word. We love having you back. It is awesome. Thank you. I'm going to pray for us now, and then we're going to head to our other parts of the episode. So, don't know why I'm doing this. Just roll with it. Roll with it. Here we go. <laughs> Let's pray. God, I thank you so much for Isaac. God, I thank you that you've given him a great word this morning. And God, I pray that you would help us take it and do something with it. God, I pray that you would use us to help the hurting. God, would we be a witness to how awesome and cool and wonderful you are by the way we help the hurting. God, I pray that you give us the strength to do it, the tools to do it, and the courage to do it. God, would we be more like your son Jesus because he is awesome. We love you, we worship you, we give you all of the glory. You are worthy of it all in Jesus name. Amen. Okay, we're going to head to our Rank the Pranks now. Watch out for these ones. They're very, very funny. Let's go! My friend's done. Now, just like that. Hey! Hey! No! 
That was a great episode. Thank you so much to everybody who contributed. Thank you for sending in your videos. We love seeing them. They really make us smile. We hope you had an epic morning this morning at Kids Church Online. We pray that God spoke to you. And hey, if he did, make sure you tell us about it because we really want to hear from you. We love it when God speaks to you. So let us know. I hope you have an amazing rest of your week. Am I right in thinking that it's going to be school holidays now? Or have you got one more week? Whichever way, summer holidays are coming and we are ready. Let's go. <laughs> Exciting stuff. Have an awesome week. See you soon. Bye.